Hello, my fellow readers. This is our Dark Symphony 777 with something very special. So, like the video, subscribe to the channel, click on that bell for notifications, and leave a comment in the comment section below on your thoughts of the story. So, I am... When I come across certain fan fictions, there comes a time where you come across something so out of place, out of left field, that you have to talk about it. And then there's shit like this. I'm not going to give this, I'm not going to give this author the time of day to do a review because this is not a fan fiction. This is a soapbox. This is a soapbox from a pretentious idiot who want who wanted to do a thing? I'm not gonna leave a link. I'm not gonna leave a link to the story in the description. I just wanted to talk about this story a little bit. Don't worry, this, this story caught me so off guard because it's a Vocaloid. It's in the Vocaloid section, but it's not a Vocaloid story. That I have, I want to at least talk about it and talk about this dumb habit of authors using fan fiction to post original stories on, which is it's it's really dumb thing to do because they do because fan fiction has a sister site, Fiction Press, where you can put post original content, and even then the story. I don't even know. I don't even know what to say about the story. Like you can literally just read these two paragraphs, and you kind of get you you literally just get the the gist of the entire story. Like I'm not. I'm. This is just insulting. It's not a fan fiction. It's not even a regular story. It's a soapbox. So the author can expose, espouse his beliefs and basically insult anyone. Why? Why do people have the need to do this? I don't know. Maybe, maybe they feel inadequate. Like if you go to this person's profile, deletes any negative comments. So probably this person... Really doesn't like to take criticism. So I might as well I might as well at least talk about the plot. The plot is just just nonsense. A guy a Gary Stu decides to randomly kill a bunch of people because they're killing animals. Fine, you wanna do something like that? Fine. Don't make him a Gary Stu. Don't, don't make him just so in the right because, like you, like again, you could just go, you just read these two and it's just so bad. I don't want to talk about this, but I, but like I said, this story caught me so off guard that I at least wanted to talk about it. The prose is bad. The story is bad. The characters are bad. Everything about the story is bad. Why is it here? Because... No. Fiction press. Because this exists. Like, this is literally just a story. This is literally just ori original content. I'll tell you why. The person thought... And this is just my opinion... This person thought he could post his original work on fanfiction because it would get more traffic. That's ba that's basically it. He just he he thought he'd get attention th through this. And this person is a very sad, strange little man who seems to be obsessed with animals. Wouldn't be surprised if he's working for PETA, because this reads like a big 
propagandic PETA message. And I just want to... I'm just done, I'm just done with this story. I, I wasted a couple... I wasted a day and a half read this. So I can at least know what I'm talking about. I'm like, no. <laughs> but when I started recording, it's like, no, I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna give the author the time of day to talk about this in any significant form. Just, just no. Just no. No.